guys okay? Uh, yeah, luckily. Man, that was some real shit. Even worse was that effing... So that's what she's really like, huh? <sighs> How about you, Joker? She really whacked you good. You said it. Damn that Alice. Acting like she's top shit. I'm gonna be so pissed off until we finally get back at her. So, where are we now? Looks like we wound up underground. I'd say it's some sort of garbage dump. For now, let's just focus on getting out of here. This place is disgusting. Who just dumps people into garbage like that? Let's find a way out as soon as possible. We don't know what we'll run into either. Let's keep an eye on how we're holding up as we press on. Is this place? Who are you? I am Sophia, humanity's companion. Correct. That means I make for a good companion to people. Are you human? Do you have a name? Joker. Okay. I memorized it. Joker, do you know where this place is? Hey, I just heard something! Uh, I mean, who are you? What is it, Joker? Uh, uh can I help you? A raccoon? <sighs> try a cat! Wait, don't try a cat! Make up your mind. Anyway, who's this? Got a real funky getup. Uh, companion? Like your. I am Sophia, humanity's companion. Were you dumped down here by that Alice girl too? Hmm. I just learned that I have no memories, so I do not know. Wait, what? Hey, you two! Come here for a second! Who is that, Joker? She said she doesn't have any memories? She can't 
came out of a giant box? What kind of crazy shit is that? Way too weird. She doesn't seem to be a shadow, though. She doesn't even seem hostile. Well, whatever she is, we still gotta find a way out. Nobody's solving any problems in this dump, that's for sure. In trouble? Whoa! Where did you... If you're in trouble, I can help. I am humanity's companion. My purpose is to be helpful to humans. So, you want to help us out? Correct. What is your problem? Well, uh, we're lost. I guess we're looking for a way out of here? A way? Will reaching the surface solve your problem of a way out of here? Uh, yeah. It would? Okay, I've got it. I'm searching for a way out of here. Alone? What now, Joker? Right. She might be able to get us out of this dump. Are you sure about that? She's still super suspicious. But I guess we shouldn't ditch her either. Hey, hey, you better watch out for shadows! Oh crap, too late! Get behind us, Sophia! Come from. Nobody's coming for us if we go down. Let's get it. Woo! We got through that somehow. Sophia, right? You heard her anything? No problems here. Why was I attacked? Assaulting others without reason is not proper behavior. Uh not exactly sure how to explain it, but those guys are called Shadows. And we're the Phantom Thieves. We're considered dangerous rebels by the ruler of this place. Intruders they want to eliminate. The Phantom Thieves? That's really cool. That's what you have to say? It's a compliment, I guess. Anyway, there is a shit ton of Shadows around here. If you want to help us, then let's all go together. I can find a way out of here. You only need to wait for me. You're actually going to help us out? I have been helping you this entire time. Joker helped me first. Now I will be helpful for him. Use me as needed, Joker. <laughs> All right, you're weird, but I guess you really do want to help. It's your goal, Joker. Okay, that sounds nice, Joker. Along with the cat and the skeleton. Wait, I'm not a skeleton. <laughs> Skull short for Skullington now. No, wait, just because I look like this doesn't make me a cat. Joker! I'm Skull, don't screw it up. And I'm Mona. Okay? Don't you forget it. What has upset you? All right. Let's be careful. We'd be fine, but we don't want to endanger Sophia. Try staying out of sight. Sophia with us. We should just avoid it if we can. Are you saying that's in your way? Yeah, we can't escape unless we get past here. Okay, I've got it. Huh? Got what? What the hell? <laughs> Yo, wait up! <laughs> Who are you? Intruders!
that a persona? What are you doing? I am helping the Phantom Thieves. Don't take it personally. Transformations. I copied what you do and ended up like this. Right? It's not just the clothes. Uh, are you some kind of persona user? Persona? The things you were using during the fight. Those boxes flying around. That was a weapon. I needed it to fight. Sophia, just what in the world are you? I am Sophia, humanity's companion. Yeah, we already heard that one. Hmm. There's still just too much we don't know. But we don't have the time to figure it out now either. Getting out of here needs to be our number one priority. Yeah, we really don't need her getting any more attention from the enemy. Hey, let's just have her help us out. Considering what we just saw, I don't think we'll have a problem. Agreed. We have no idea what's ahead of us. The more firepower, the better. Can you lend us a hand, Sophia? Okay, I've got it. Right, you'll be counting on me. Well, let's move. Lead the way, Shorty. Understood. Oh, right. Keep track of how you're holding up. You need any healing items? Oh. Okay, this one. Okay. This might be of interest. Huh. Nope. No shadows here. I've located a treasure chest. It's inside, Joker. Suspicious looking. Never know what you might find. Oh, Joker, what did you find? Remember? Yeah. 
possible. Stay on your toes, Joker! The best feels just like me. Rabbit step! Shadow as far as I know. Keep it moving. Wait! Shadow's ahead. I haven't spotted us yet. Should I wipe them out for you? Here's a tip on us phantom thieves. We avoid charging headfirst into battle whenever possible. Let's try those stairs for now. in there, Joker? You thinking what I'm thinking? Just yet. Are we in a dead end? There. If we climb there, we can proceed. Guess there's no other option. I've got eyes on them! They just don't quit! Let's take him down, Joker! Persona! You're mine! Let's go! Let's go. Hmm. My. This 
this one. That. Okay. Persona! His power! Finally made it out. This is still the metaverse, though. Stay on guard. Please wait. What is it, Sophia? Find something? <sighs> I have found it. A way out of here is nearby. For real? Wait, how'd you figure that out? I suddenly knew it. Like... Seriously? The exit is close. Follow me. Hey, wait! Sophia! What is her deal? Uh, I don't know, but we need to move it! Is this the way out you mentioned, Sophia? Yes, this is what I had detected previously. Uh, and it is? It's fine. It leads outside. Leads outside? Everything will get all... <laughs> for a moment, but then you'll be out of here. What the hell kind of explanation is that? Okay. Trust me, Joker. I'm 
glad you're willing to trust me. Hmm. Looks like we've only got one option here. Huh? Ain't you coming too? I am... What should I do? Joker's got the right idea, Sophia. This place is crawling with shadows. Staying here would only end badly for you. But... Jeez, what's it gonna take? What? What are you doing? We don't leave folks behind to die. Just get in the damn portal with us. So you want me to come with you? Uh, okay. Well, here it goes. One, two... This is the real world, right? Yep, looks like we're back all right. You have successfully returned from the jail. Welcome back. Jail? Hang on, Sophia, where'd she go? I don't think I'm seeing her. Hey Shorty, get your ass over here! Kill that in public, idiot! Need something? Was that Sophia's voice? Huh, where is she? I'm in front of you, inside Joker's phone. What's with the floating head? Yo! Whoa, she just popped up! Oh, did you change your outfits? Is that really you, Sophia? Yep, I'm really me. But who are you? I'm still Mona. I just look like a cat in this world. Mona? You're Mona? So, you really weren't a raccoon. I already told you that. Wait, why are you on his phone now? Why am I? Because I am an AI. An AI? A, uh... uh... That's that smart thing, right? Futaba told us all about it. She's an artificial intelligence. For real? Because it was the closest one to me. I was thrown into endless light. When I tracked down Joker's scent, I ended up here. His scent? Who are you, Morgana? So since she's an AI, she turned into data when she came to this world. Does that mean you're living in his phone? It is somewhat small, but it's cozy and has everything I need. Here to join me? <laughs> I, I, I don't even have the energy. Anyway, it's a big relief knowing you made it out of there safely. Hey, but what, what about all those other people we saw in there? Are they still, you know... I don't know. But I seriously doubt normal folks would be able to fight against that. I get what you're saying, but if we charge in without a plan, we're just going to wind up captured too. A new part of the metaverse has its own version of a palace that we access through Emma. It even has a ruler shadow. Odds are that something horrible is happening right now. Right. Talking about this here is no good. Let's get to LeBlanc. We'll hammer out our course of action with everyone there. And what about her? It appears I cannot exit this phone. When I came to this world, I connected to the internet and learned a great many things. But my memory is still erased. I also found no means of data recovery. Furthermore, I am stuck here. What should I do next? So we're both 
crashing somewhere. Also, introducing Sophia to everyone else will probably make the explanation easier. I uh, wonder how that's gonna go over. Especially when they hear all the palace type shit. There are more phantom thieves? Yeah, we got ourselves a whole gang. One of them will probably flip her wig over you too. Okay. That sounds pretty fun. I see. You're saying you entered the Metaverse with Alice Hiragi's invitation and met a sentient AI named Sophia, who is now in your phone. When you put it that way, you make it sound crazy. But I'm telling you, it's the truth. Up. You want to believe in us or not? We understand. None of us would make up something like this. However, there's a chance this Sophia may know more than we do about this situation. She's still with you, right? Could we speak with her? Yeah. Let's see if there's anything Sophia can add that could help us figure out what's happening. Could you come join us, Sophia? Yo, Phantom Thieves! Sophia, humanity's companion. That's really Sophia? Wow, I can't believe this is happening. Is this some sort of hideout? There seem to be a number of phantom thieves present. <laughs> She's humming to herself? What in heaven? Such an adorable design. I can feel the charm, the pain. Tenacity within. Wait, what? So, yeah, this is Sophia. Nice meeting you. Okay, an AI with genuine will is just way too advanced. Right? We couldn't believe it either. Uh, that's right, we're meeting for the first time. Nice to meet you, Sophia. I'm Makoto Nijima. My name's Haru Okumura. We're both college students, but I also help out with my family's company. I'm An Takamaki. I'm a third year in high school, and I do some modeling, too. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. I continuously strive to master the arts as we know them. <laughs> so, I'm next, huh? I'm Futaba Sakura, and I kind of suck at socializing, but I want to be friends and stuff. Ah, you did great, Futaba. In fact, I bet you and Sophia will get along real awesome. Makoto, Haru, An, Yusuke, and Utaba. I'll remember that. You all have much more normal names than Joker. Ooh, right. We skipped that part. Uh, so, we're the Phantom Thieves, but... We call each other by code names in the metaverse, so our enemies won't discover our real identities. Code names? My name's actually Ryuji Sakamoto. The cat's Morgana. And he's... Okay, I'll remember that. Um, so you really are a computer program? Correct. Would you like to see my source code? Oh, yes, yes, yes! Show me, show me! Take it down a notch, okay? You can see it after we get through these questions. First off, why were you in the metaverse? I do not know, because my memory is gone. Could you have the AI version of Amnesia or something? That seems difficult to recover from. Uh, if your data just crashed, I could take a look and try restoring it. It is impossible. I have already tried every potential solution. <laughs> yeah, based on your specs, I guess it's not surprising you already thought of that. Can you recall anything at all? Only the command I received at initialization. You don't sound too sure of that. Humanity's Companion. That was the command I was issued. I remember nothing else. Yeah, don't let it bother you too much, Sophia. I was in the exact same situation when I first met these guys. Thank you. I have 
still got a shit ton of questions about Sophia, but we have some real work to do first. Right. The metaverse. And what we saw. From what you saw, that means Alice Hiragi has a palace in Shibuya, right? Yeah. She was calling herself the Queen, being all high and mighty, ordering shadows around. All that kind of shit. There's no doubt that was the cognitive world, but... Something about it was awfully different from the palaces. What is it? Real humans were being attacked by shadows. There were people inside the palace? You mean they had access to the Metaverse Navigator? But that disappeared for all of us. I know, right? That's where this comes in. You mean... Emma? Yep. For some reason, this thing worked just like the MetaNav did. We accidentally entered Alice's Emma keyword and got sent to the Metaverse. Wait! That means Emma is dangerous! But you can just uninstall it. The MetaNav didn't work like that. There's one more thing that's been bothering me. When we got back to this world, Emma said we returned from the jail. Jail? The only thing we figured out is that this new place is called a jail. So, could you guys check out the palace, or jail, or whatever with us? Good point. There's no progressing any further unless we see it with our own eyes. I'm also having a hard time buying Alice as the ruler of a palace. Are we going to scout it out together? I think the sooner the better. Is it even safe for us to enter, though? What if we all just end up captured? There were no enemies in the vicinity of the exit. It's fine to enter through there. Well, are we going to head back to that place tomorrow? Right, we've got our mission. Very well. I look forward to seeing this jail. Let's say we meet at the connecting bridge in Shibuya. But first... I get to see Sophia's code! You promised, remember? Oh, this is gonna be the info dump of a lifetime! I promise, you won't feel a thing. <laughs> Are you confident this is wise? <laughs> I guess so. I mean, at least we know she's got computer skills. Man, this is what happens when we get back together? Oh, talk about an ass-busting summer vacation. <gasps> huh? What is it? What about our life-changing Kyoto excursion? Our barbecue extravaganza? Extravaganza? You mean our camping trip? It looks like we'll just have to postpone it. Damned metaverse. I vow to slice you to ribbons. Aha. You can't slice the metaverse, dude. Just save it for the shadows. over here. Damn, so that's it. So what do you think, Futaba? How's Sophia's code look? Well, her programmer is a genius, no doubt about that. You can figure a person out by their code, and not just their skill level. Their habits, thought processes, even their personalities are there. This code is so advanced that even I can't read it and comprehend it right away. It'll take me weeks, even months, to actually grasp how Sophia works. Take you months? Ooh, that's a serious program. I don't understand. Do you mean I'm impressive? Yeah, you're impressive. You're some kind of super AI. If you ever went public, everyone would call Emma old hat. Old hat? When something was popular at one point but stopped being popular, it becomes old hat. It's a saying people don't really use anymore. Okay, I've got it. You are very knowledgeable, Futaba. Don't go teaching her too much weird stuff, okay? While we're at it, did you see anything about Sophia's past? Her programmer's name? Or a company's, maybe? Ah, <sighs> nothing yet. And most of those leave a signature of some sort in their work, too. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna keep cracking at it from home. 
I'll let you know once I find anything new. Mm -hmm. I'll crack it yet. Well, folks, time for me to make like a tree. She made... like a tree? Boy, was that a hell of a day. I never would have imagined something like this would happen. I know, but we don't have a choice. We'll cut loose once things are settled. Well, the metaverse reappearing may have been a surprise, but even that doesn't compare with Sophia. Did you call for me? We were just talking about how you're a huge mystery. Says the talking cat. Eh, uh, good point. Wait, I don't have to take that from some mystery app. By the way, how does some top-of-the-line program lose all its memory, huh? I mean, AI are supposed to be super smart, right? That is... inarguably true. Aw, don't get too down over it. I am humanity's companion. If I am not helpful, then I am useless. Don't be so hard on yourself. At least you remember that much, right? Right. I think that means it's important. But is being helpful all you'll do to become a good companion? Is that not how it works? Please explain. How else can one be a companion? Huh? Well, uh... <laughs> uh, that's, uh... I guess you just have to find a way to understand the human heart. Hearts? Uh, right. Then you'll be able to empathize with other people and be a good companion to them. I guess. The human heart. Look, just, just don't worry about it. All you need to do is join us and learn from all the kinds of people we meet. In exchange, you lend a hand to the Phantom Thieves. So I guess you could call this a deal. Okay, that is a decent deal. Especially since it should help me become a good companion for humanity. Yep, so long as it's good with our leader. do that. Then it's a deal. Glad to have you on board, Sophia. We've got plenty of scouting to do tomorrow. We should get some rest. Okay. Good night, Morgana. going to be infiltrating the jail. Are we ready? We've done this many a time. We can't imagine anyone being phased by this. <laughs> yeah, bro! Bring it! We're very short on intel, so we need to be cautious. We'll just scout the general area for this trip. We use Emma to enter, right? Is there anything special we need to do? Um, no. We just opened the app and said the right keyword. Find the right name in Emma's search results, then enter the correct keyword on the friend request screen. Yeah, you got it, Futaba. Ah, leave it to the super hacker to explain this stuff. That had nothing to do with hacking. Even you should know how to explain it. All that's left is to choose our point of entry. There will be no enemies in the area from which we escaped yesterday. Upon reaching the relevant location, you will only need to speak the keyword. Seems all that's left is to trust Sophia and see where she leads us. Now let's do this thing! Well, did we make it? Phantom Thief attire. Yeah, you too. Oh, I've forgotten this feeling. The 
fusion of form and function. Truly magnificent. Look, it's Beauty Thief! My name is Beauty Thief! Let's not fool around here. I admit, though, these clothes do bring back some memories. We can reminisce later. Take a look at that view. So, this is the jail? Just what is that building? This place is bonkers. Nothing escapes the atrocious color scheme of this place. It looks like that because of someone's cognition, correct? Right. Most likely Alice's. The distortion has to be exceptionally strong there for a reason. So you're saying that's the stronghold of the Queen ruling over this jail? Its appearance certainly fits the notion. The buildings around here still look pretty normal, though. Looks like that place over there has a limited range of distortion. The first time we came here, we entered by the crossing down there. That's where we saw a group of cop shadows taking stuff out of people's chests. Oh, you mean that jewel we saw? The hell was up with that? That may have been a desire. Yo, Phantom Thieves! Ah! Sophia! Holy crap, an actual AI in human form! Wow, you're so cute, Sophia! Such a fascinating form you've taken. I can't stop staring at the beautifully curved lines. I've never seen an outfit like that! Can I try floofing it? Floofing? I think she wants to get a feel for the fabric of your clothes while hugging you, Sophia. Request denied. I am neither a child nor a pet. Uh, no floofing. By the by, how does H work for an AI? Not right now. Sophia, tell us more about the desire you mentioned. That is the term used by shadows here. They say things such as, seize their desires, and we must offer these desires to the monarch. Based on their language and behavior, I speculate the aforementioned jewel was in fact a desire. That does make sense. When we saw Alice here, she mentioned desires too. So if Alice is the monarch, then she really is the ruler of this jail. But these desires, are they actually made up of the things people desire? Seizing desires of all things, what use would they have for those? Finding out what happened to the folks who got jumped could tell us something. Where could those victims be now? I don't see a place from here where they may be held. I don't know. Maybe they're being held somewhere else. Say, about those people you witnessed being attacked, are you sure they were humans? What do you mean? Well, couldn't they have been shadows or something? If there are humans getting captured and imprisoned in this jail right now, wouldn't there be a huge commotion in our world? Groups of people going missing out of the blue. Now there's a point. I haven't heard a peep about that online. So no one is actually disappearing from reality? I see. Shadows. What are shadows? A shadow's the parts of you suppressed within your subconscious. It's basically just your other self. Does that mean their main selves are all right? No. The shadow and the actual self are two sides of the same coin. So if a desire is taken from someone's shadow, what happens to the person in reality? I gotta say, I'm getting a bad vibe from all this. Are they trying to influence reality by doing something to the shadows? And how are we to act? This sounds like a crisis. Shouldn't we rescue the victims right away? No, that was just speculation. After all, We've only witnessed the cognitive world side of things. Until we find out how all this is affecting the real world, we can only know half of what's going on. I'd say the first thing we need to do is investigate Alice and her victims. Plus, if we make the wrong move in the cognitive world, there's a chance the ruler could have a shutdown in the real world. Right. We need to get the story straight before we make any real moves or we'll just be doing damage. Yeah, we should get some sleep. Hang on, you still have some investigating to do. Can we please get into that once we're out of here? Okay, let's get out of here.
Well, we've confirmed the presence of the jail. Next, we look into Alice and any potential victims. And how do we do that? Look into what? The usual rumor mills. Looking for anything about Alice. Gossip about her being abusive or other messed up stuff. Good idea. Let's gather any intel that we can, both online and on the streets. Huh. I've got the web crawling covered. But if we're ever to gain conclusive proof of any rumors, I believe we'll need direct access to her at some point. Direct access to a pop star sounds awfully tough. Uh... Uh, about that. I may get to meet Alice tomorrow. What? For real? How? Well, I had asked the modeling agency's president if I could meet her sometime. I heard she'd be on a TV show filming nearby, so I asked if I could visit the set. I was hoping to learn from her by watching her in action. I gave up on it after making plans with you guys, but I might be able to get the ball rolling again in time. The timing's nothing short of kismet. Yeah! Way to go, Lady On! But I'm not making any promises about it, and there's no way we'd get to approach her either. Plus, our full group's just too big. The most I could even ask to bring is just one more person. Well, that settles that. We're counting on you. Give Alice shit when you meet her so you can get some evidence out of her. Hey, you better not be thinking of trying anything funny. I'm the one who'll suffer for it. I think I'll tag along with you. We'll be fine so long as no one sees me. For today, let's focus on her potential victims. Let's go.